With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. And the Bears hands team able to pounce on it and get the football. Well, there's two sides to every coin. You come on the road, you get the onside kick to start the game. What a boost, but you don't get it. And now your back's against the wall a little bit. You're exactly right. You nailed it perfectly. And so many ways to go at it when you're on the road. You think to yourself, well, if we start on defense, we blitz them early to try and create a big play. If we start on offense, we throw the big pass downfield. In this case, they said, forget all of that. Let's do it on special teams and try and catch them off guard with an onside kick unsuccessfully. On second down, here's Fields. He'll get that complete to his tight end, Cole Komet. Touchdown! Cole Komet, 46 yards. And the Bears will claim the early lead as they're on the board first here tonight. Point after, right down the middle. And it's now a 7-0 game. Now after the touchdown here, Santos to kick this one away. Brandon Ayuk now from his end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. Mahomes now on first down. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Moss. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight, second and two. Mahomes to throw on second down. Got a man, it's Randy Moss. Six yards the pickup, and that's a first down. Here's Mahomes to throw. They'll find Ayuk open right side. And they're well past midfield, just a yard or two shy of the 40. So into Bear territory now. This is first and 10 at the 42-yard line. Pass the 20. And he's brought down after a very nice game. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. Operating from the red zone now, Mahomes. This will be caught by Randy Moss. And this will leave him a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. Well, that's not just his first, not his second, already his third completion here on the opening drive. And I, I think it's safe to say that getting him the ball in this game, one of their top priorities. And the top priority for the defense has got to be finding ways to cover him. And I don't think you can have one basic coverage to get it done. You have to throw a number of coverages at him, make him think as he's running downfield, and hope you touchdown for the Niners. Ken Walker. Touchdown grab. And the 49ers respond to that opening drive touchdown with one of their own. The extra point splits the uprights, and we are tied at seven. Boy, tie game, first quarter, but still they're going to go with the onside kick. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 here is the kicks away. And the Bears' hands team able to pounce on it. And get the football. So an onside kick fail in the first quarter. Not sure I completely see the logic there. It's not apparent, is it? You almost have to go deeper, I think. And maybe if we try and work along with them and, and speculate a little bit here, they almost like they need to steal possessions in this game. And maybe they don't match up possession for possession with the opposite team. They've got to steal it and try and gain an advantage. And they tried. They just didn't get it done. Now this one complete downfield on the left side. The first catch for Jeffrey. Good enough for a first down. Fields changing the play. They run it on first for Foreman. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. 
Now they contend with a second and 12 after the loss. Off play action, Fields. Touchdown, Bears! Cole Komet, two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Bears have taken the lead. Extra point right down the middle. And that makes the score 14 to 7. Now after the touchdown here, Santos to kick this one away. Ayuk to return it from his end zone. And they'll get him down right at the 25-yard line for the same result had he opted for the touchback. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. This drive here beginning probably with a pair of motivated grooves. Remember, the offense scored a touchdown on their last timeout. Looking to repeat that in Charles' defense. They were very frustrated after giving up six the last time on the field. And frankly, it's just a battle of wills in a lot of ways because you know they're both motivated. They both game plan for this drive, and they both have specific outcomes in mind. To and that's caught inside the 30. A big play there for the Niners. 47 yards. On first down, Mahomes. And looking for Kittle, but it's intercepted. And the Bears are going to get this back to their own 34-yard line. Fields and the Bears now with a first and 10 at the 34. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And that's complete to Jeffrey. It'll go as a gain of four. And that will bring up second down. Here's Fields. Being chased out left. Oh, what a read on the outside as it's intercepted. And he will be out of bounds with no time remaining. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. Been a little bit of an interesting start. The first drive for him, Charles, they had the passing touchdown. The second drive, he threw the interception. So we'll see what this third drive of the ball game brings. Yeah, it's got a tiebreaker, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, that's a tough part for them and for him because, yeah, things went really well on that first one, not so well on the second one. He wants to get back to what he did to get this game going. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. So into Bear territory now. This is first and 10 at the 34. Now here's Mahomes. Throw left side, complete to Moss. And they move this all the way down to the nine. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit them, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. And a quick throw here. That's complete. A gain of seven that time. Second goal. Well, that's now four completions in a row. A good bounce back following the interception last drive. Certainly not letting it affect him, that's for sure. And we all know interceptions are going to happen. So the big trick, don't let it affect him. And across the goal line, into the end zone. Touchdown, 49ers. Kenneth Walker with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the 49ers are within an extra point of tying up this ball game. Point after, right down the middle. And we are tied at 14. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Here the Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. They start from scratch here, so to speak. 14 all following the interception last time that led to a score. Now they've got it first and 10. And he's got Rome. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Here's Fields. That'll be caught by Foreman. 
And he has a big gain inside the 40 before being dropped. So the ball moves from 138 to the other as they come up on first and 10. Fields now to throw. And he will find the open man. It's D.J. Moore. Add the game here to the previous play, and it's better than 40 yards total. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. Second quarter, two minutes to go. Tie ball game. one down to about the 17. Field's going to hurry his guys to the line. From the 17, Fields. And he will find his man on the outside. And he'll be out of bounds, taking it just shy of the 10 at the 11 or the 12. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. Fields to throw on third and one. And open is Jeffrey. Touchdown, Chicago. Alshon Jeffrey, an 11-yard touchdown. And the Bears have moved out in front. The extra point splits the uprights, and the lead is now 21-14. Now after the touchdown, here Santos to kick this one away. to return it from his end zone. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. They'll look for a drive to tie this up. Down 21-14 as they have it for... Oh, and his early struggles continue. Here's another one intercepted. And he's going to get this on down to the 13-yard line. From the 13 now, they work on first and 10. Back to throw. Fields. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. Looking to speed things up here, going with some tempo. Now Fields. And it's intercepted at the goal line. There he goes, right side. And the 49ers will take over here as they get it up to the 43-yard line. Well, I would guess it combined, if you spoke to both defenses, neither side has a lot to celebrate today. They haven't had a lot of stops, but that one right there, that's a big one because they stole points away with that play. And just as importantly, picked up a key stop on an offense that's been really impressive here in the early going. The 49ers now going to use the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with just under 50 seconds remaining in half number one. Second down in a yard. A gear for Walker running right. And some solid footwork there as he'll take this down to about the 38. Now San Francisco going to call their second timeout as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. On first and 10, here's Mahomes. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Whenever I see a drop like that, I have to kind of take a step back and check myself a little bit. So used to seeing those big guys make big-time, spectacular plays that when they drop one, I have to remind myself, we ask a lot out of these guys. Block and catch the football, not easily done in today's NFL. First down now, but that clock rolling. Mahomes going to throw. Flushed out right. Mahomes hit, he lost the football. And this is picked up by the Bears. And he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. And he brings it back. Can you believe it? An offensive disaster on the final play of the first half. They just had to hold on to the ball. Oh, 
backbreaker. That'll drive the coach, the offensive coordinator, just crazy. You get it all the way down there in the red zone, can't capitalize. Instead, they go the other way on the fumble return for a touchdown. How about the aggressiveness of the defense, though? They're not about to just fall on a fumble, are they? Scoop and score is their motto, and they just did it. So we have come to halftime in what's already a two-touchdown game. As it's time now to send you back stateside to Orlando, Florida, and check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach, Ayuk to return it from his end zone. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. This offense, Charles, had a strong first half throwing the football, at least in terms of yardage, but that hasn't translated so far on the scoreboard as they begin the third quarter here trailing and looking for a little momentum. Yeah, you're right about that because, you know, let's face it, in the first half, most of their focus was in the passing game, and to their credit, resulted in a healthy amount of yardage. So I would think that at halftime, they're going to anticipate that defense loosening up a little bit to try and cover the passing lanes. They've got to get the running game going, and there should be some gaps to run through now. Mahomes to throw on third and one. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. Fakes a spike. And Mahomes misfires again, and it's intercepted. 